twice and blonde go ring. Yes. Good looking. Good looking. Oh, oh thank you. Oh, Lima Pulu, ja? Lima Pulu. Gratos. Ja. Kan moest ook aan. Ja. Welcome everyone to this new video. I am at my house. It feels like it's been a while since I started my video from my house. But I'm not gonna stay here for long. I'm gonna go to Uluwatu right now. I'm gonna go together with Susan. We're gonna do really exciting things. If everything works out, we're gonna go with the helicopter, which is one of my dreams. I'm really excited. <laughs> so yeah, let's get this video started. I'm gonna stay for two nights with Susan. And we're gonna go to beautiful beaches. And I'm gonna bring you guys along. So let's get this video started. We have arrived. I'm reunited with Susan again <laughs> and we have some really good food and ice coffee of course enjoy we have arrived hi <laughs> hey we made it to Uluwatu the drive was like 15 minutes and now we have to wait for around one hour until we can check in so we are in the restaurant here of the hotel and it's time to do some work on our laptops this is the issue of traveling with a backpack. I want to take my laptop out, but it's all the way in the bottom. And there are so many clothes and things that I have to take out first. But I have to do it because we have to wait for more than one hour. So I will do some work. Yes, got it. We made it into our hotel room. It's Woohoo! Wow! <laughs> it's actually way better than we expected. It's a really big bed. And we have a cute bathroom, shower, everything we need. And this is in the middle of Uluwatu. If you have the maps of Bali, it's exactly in the middle. And we even have a small balcony with this amazing view. Wow, there's even a temple over there. And this is actually one of the things that we always do. If we arrive, we always organize our stuff straight away. So it feels like home. We're staying here for two nights. We just unpacked everything and then we are going to the beach. And tonight we're gonna go to the really famous traditional Balinese dance on the cliff in Uluwatu. It's gonna be really beautiful. Moments later. Outfit change. Oh my god, this is so bad. Oh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow. Let's go to Padang Padang Bay. Beach. Ayo. Beach. Beach. <laughs> there we go. We're gonna go with the two of us on one bike. So let's go to Padang Bay. Padang Padang Bay and I've never seen it so busy here. There are so many scooters and I think we have to get a parking ticket over here. There is a really really long line. Okay we just got our tickets. It's 15k per person and there are some monkeys here so I'm gonna put my sunglasses in my bag because the monkeys can steal and I'm really scared of that. So let's walk down. I hope it's not too busy. So there are two roads. This is the normal stairs, but we took the mysterious one. Yeah, <laughs> always. But it was really nice and here's the beach. Wow, it's super busy. I've never seen it so busy here. And actually this is the beach where I lost my first road. So it's kind of sad. I lost it all the way in the end over there in the morning while it was sunrise, like a year ago or something. I have my drone with me, but I'm not gonna go so crazy again. And over there is the bridge. So if you're gonna go further, you will pass this bridge and you can see the beach from up there. And it's really beautiful, but I've never seen it so busy. Wow. We walked a little bit more to the right side and it's actually really nice to go here more to the right side because there's almost no one and it's really quiet. Let's feel the water, it's, ooh, it's cold. Oh, but it's really nice and refreshing. Wow, there's so many people. And I'm not sure if you can see it on the camera, but there's a plane over there because the airport is on that side. So if you're chilling on this beach, you can watch all the planes all day. That's so beautiful. And actually when it's a bit later during the day, it's gonna be low tide. So you have all the rocks like here. It's actually really nice to come early in the morning because then you have the blue ocean and it's gonna be high tide. Wow, this is such a dream to stay here. The sun is really bright here, so I have to put sunscreen because otherwise I'm blonde goreng. <laughs> blonde goreng means a fried Dutch person in English. And I have this sunscreen and it smells really nice. It's for babies. 
I'm mentally preparing myself to fly my drone because as I said before, this is the beach where I lost my drone around one year ago. But I am not gonna go so far over the ocean, but I really want to shoot something here. So I think it's gonna be worth it if I take care. So are you guys ready to see the beautiful drone shots? There we go. My drone, as you maybe know, I crashed it so many times, so it doesn't work so good anymore. So the gimbal was stuck. So I didn't fly so much, maybe only for one minute. But I'm happy I did it and I was really scared, <laughs> but I'm proud of myself. Good. A much needed coke <laughs> Because it's really hot in the sun and we are really burned And I put sunscreen all the time but I'm still burned Makasi eh? Thank you! at the next destination and it is a cliff and we're now gonna walk down and the view will be really beautiful from up there look at the reflection of the sun already wow we made it to the top of the cliff look how beautiful this is it's actually kind of scary because this is not really stable and there's just a whole hole here I hope you can see it on the camera. Look here, it's coming. It's going above us. We will be in a helicopter in two days. This is unbelievable. I actually can't wait. back to the top but there's a monkey and this local guy is gonna try to catch him because he almost wanted to steal some things we made it hopefully on time to the famous temple on the cliff here in Uluwatu it's quite busy I've actually been here one time before in 2019 I guess but then I didn't watch the dance and now we definitely want to see it if it's still available because it's quite busy yeah let's go inside we have to take care of the monkeys and we have to wear our sarong as a skirt because we have to cover up of course <laughs> black and white black and white black and white yes good looking good looking oh thank you yeah. yeah, I got one already. Yeah. This one is fine? Yeah, fine. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. I actually got the purple one from here, but I'm, I have my own. Look at this tree, by the way. It's so beautiful. We got our ticket. It was 50k to enter, but the dance from 6 o'clock is already sold out. So at 7, there's another dance. So we can watch the sunset from this temple. And then at 7, we're going to see the dance. I'm really excited about it because I've never seen it. Only in some local temples in Ubud, but not this whole, like a show. It's actually a show. Yeah. Thank you. We got our tickets. They're 150 per person, and there's a whole paper with information. And the show is gonna be over there. this temple for a second because we only ate breakfast this morning well we actually really only ate breakfast yeah so this is our lunch at six o'clock oh my god they're monkeys so we went outside to have our lunch <laughs> and we're gonna share one with sigoring and two kalapa and then we're gonna go back and see the show here you can see that the lady is cutting the 
like a lot by the coconut. So that's the situation. I'm really curious about the dance, but actually this place is so crowded and it's actually full with tourists because it's a temple on top of a cliff. So that's really unique, but it's really, really busy, especially on Saturdays in the weekend. We have our coconut and it's so nice and refreshing. It's a cool coconut. Kamusuka. Oh, did you clean the spoon? No. I just. This is good for your uh, yeah. immune system. <laughs> Our nasi goreng with chicken has arrived, so we're gonna eat it now here, and then in 20 minutes our show is gonna start. Okay, let's try bon it. Bon appetit. <laughs> I miss nasi goreng. Yeah. Always good. Always juicy. Mm. Mm. Wow. We just entered, and look how many people there are. Wow. <laughs> from the dance we're now in a really cute cafe it's called salad lab and you can create your own salad here so we're gonna do that for takeaway so we can eat it in our room the dance was almost one hour and it was really impressive i've never seen it i know that many tourists go here and i'm happy that we also went now and that we explored it it's only really 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 crowded there's so many people so if you want to go there be aware of that or maybe go in a weekday but yeah it was all fun so now we're waiting for our salad and then we're gonna go to our hotel and tomorrow we're gonna go to explore Uluwatu again. So I will see you tomorrow. Hello, good morning. We made it to Drifter, that's a cafe close to all the nice cafes over here in Uluwatu. And I've never been here, but it's really cute. And inside is like the surf shop. So you have surfboards and all the things you need to surf. It's really island life vibes. It's really nice. So we're gonna order some food because it's already 11.39, 38. It's late for us. Like if we travel, we wake up earlier normally. Look, this is the name. It's really, really cute. Look how cute this is. You enter here and then you come inside the surf shop. And then you have to walk here to the back. And this is like the whole cafe area, and they have many things over here. And then outside is the cafe. This is so cute. Wow. We're sitting here under this tree. <laughs> oh, your food has arrived. Enjoy. My fruit salad has arrived and I've never had a fruit salad this big. Look at this. It comes with coconut yogurt and honey, but wow, this is so huge. at our first beach of today and it's called dream beach i've been here a few times before but it's quite busy now because there are many scooters hi are you together yes ten not five for two not today oh lima pulu yeah lima pulu seratus seratus dua ratus joking i only have seratus yeah, makasi. Yeah, okay. Okay, sure. Yeah. So it's 5k per person to enter. Oh, this is toch Dreamland Beach. We just had a coconut here, but it's quite busy. So it's time to go to the next beach and it's gonna be Nyang Nyang. I'm not sure if I've ever been there, but it's a 20 minutes drive with the scooter. Let's go there. I'm gonna cover up because I'm burnt already from yesterday. 
so I'm gonna put my sarong like this, otherwise my shoulders will be really, really red. To the next beach and it's called Nyang Nyang beach I think this is my first time ever and it's really pretty as you can see there is a cliff over here and we are sitting here in the shade it's actually now getting low tide so there are many rocks in the ocean but if you are here really early in the morning it's also high tide like all the beaches in Uluwatu but it's really nice and you can just drive down with the bike it's a bit scary because it's really step but I definitely will go back here again It is time to leave this beach. We're gonna go to a really beautiful sunset spot, which is called Balangan. Balangan, I think it's called. But first, at the entry of this beach, there was a small warung. So we're gonna eat something there. And yeah, it's actually really, really low tide. And the light is really beautiful, especially those trees here on the beach. It's so authentic. We made it upstairs from Nyang Nyang Beach. And we're now at this cafe called Nyang Nyang Bar and Resto. We just ordered crispy Asian chicken salad. I will let you know if it's nice or not. And we actually just found out that this is the beach where there is the really famous plain hotel. Um, it's over here in the end But it's all over Instagram So we're not gonna check it out now But let us me know in the comments if you want us to check it out Because it's really really famous So yeah, now we're gonna wait for our food And then we're gonna go to Balangan Beach To see the sunset on the really beautiful cliff there It has arrived, it looks really nice And mm. It's so nice, mm. I love it Enjoy We made it to Balangan Beach And we met up with Vishnu and his girlfriend. Vishnu has a new drone, the, the newest one. The it's Are huge, sure? it's a bit like scary. You know Are you nervous now? A little bit. Yes, okay. I am. King Kong, bye. Hi, King Kong. <laughs> have fun, King Kong. So they have a thing that they give a name to a drone. And this is King Kong. Wow, the sunset is so beautiful already. There are many, many people over here, as you can see. I've been here only one time before. <laughs> I definitely recommend to go here if you're going to Bali. It's only a little bit crowded, but it's definitely worth it. Vishnu got his drone safely back. <laughs> How was it for you? In the open area like this, uh -huh. in the ocean, this is the first one. Yeah, definitely a bit nervous. Not a bit, like... <laughs> <laughs> More, than More than a bit. It's one second later, look at the sky. Wow, this almost looks unreal. And it's so beautiful because many people have like a small barbecue and they're just sitting here making some food and eating it here and while watching the sunset. That's really nice. I would love to do that one day as well. We made it to one of my favorite places here in Uluwatu, it's called Nourish and every Wednesday and Sunday they have two pizzas for one and there's even live music so let's go inside so this is the menu of Nourish, it's really nice and I always take the four cheese truffle here we have it, the four kinds of cheese truffle pizza Susan has the same, always with her camera oh. <laughs> and what do you guys have? I have meat lovers meat lovers? you get the full pork yeah. enjoy, salamat makan hello, hello. <laughs> Oh my god, we made it back to our hotel, but there's a really big spider. Susan wants to throw a sock on it. No, I'm not gonna do it. Because if I do it, then it falls on the ground, then it crawls under our bed. And then it will eat you tonight. Maybe it will go to the door and just leave yeah. in peace. There it goes already. It's, it's walking the wrong direction. <laughs> spider even. <laughs> It's coming to you! Oh, I don't like it. Oh, I even saw the eyes. <laughs> Left! <laughs> Left! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, we're opening the door now because it smells. Huh? How can it still move? really close by it. Yeah, and then it jumps again. Should I do it? Mm. Okay, are you sure? No. <laughs> this is how we keep the door open. <laughs> 
And the door outside is also open. But I think actually there are gonna be mosquitoes now too. Oh my God. I don't know how I didn't know this place after living four years in Bali. Yeah, everyone's so good. 